Welcome to another episode of Mr. J's Workshop. This week I, I have a couple of bamboo products that I'm doing some laser engraving for some customers and I thought it was a good opportunity uh, to improve some of my engraving on bamboo. So uh, I picked up some tips and tricks on some of the laser uh, engraving forums and I'm going to give that a try and share that with you. So on this job here, uh, I have to focus out by a quarter inch. I lowered the table. Um, we did one pass at these power settings. And I, I was happy with the result. On the next job, I, I ran uh, one pass at normal focus and then a second pass out of a uh, quarter inch out of focus. And I was really happy with the results. So in the next couple jobs, I did the same thing and got the same results. So it was very consistent, you know, one pass at normal and then one pass quarter inch out of focus. And, and I had a good result. But for some reason, uh, on this job here, I ran one pass at, uh, at regular power settings and it just burnt too dark. I believe it was the bamboo. So our final example is uh, a cutting board that's masked off and I'm engraving it and I plan to color fill this with food dye. So I had to mix the coloring blue, green and red to come up with black food coloring dye and then uh, had to mix it up pretty well and then uh, I applied it to the, the engraving uh, engraved area. Uh, but I had to keep on wiping this down because it, it, it would just get too wet and I was worried about wicking into the cutting board and causing lines. After I was done, I ended up with the lines anyway. But uh, a lot of people say they have good results in using this method, but I didn't have any good results on this job. So if this was really helpful, give us a like below. Uh, please comment uh, on your thoughts of engraving bamboo uh, or your techniques. Uh, I, I really like to know uh, what you think about that. And um, with that said, we'll see you next time. Keep lasering.